Texels and how to UV unwrap. This will be a quick overview of what Texels are and then I'll speed over how to UV unwrap for those who are looking to jump right into it. In a nutshell, a Texel is the smallest unit of measurement used to represent the size of a texture space. A Texel is used as a container for pixels of a texture map. The number of pixels within a Texel is referred to as the Texel density. The Texel density determines the pixel density within an object. For example, a standard Texel density used in games is 5.12. This tells an object that every 1cm of its model contains 5.12 pixels of a texture map. Texel density is set in the UV toolkit. Before setting your Texel density and starting unwrapping, make sure your model is built to the correct scale. The object size can be checked using the distance tool or by creating a cube to the dimensions the object should be. The distance tool is found in the create drop down menu within the measurement subtool menu. To start unwrapping, open the UV editor in the UV drop down menu. This will open a window containing the UV shells of the objects selected in the scene and the UV toolkit with tools used to alter them shells and set their preferences. There are also more tools and actions in the drop down menu of the UV editor window. Keep in mind there are different approaches to unwrapping depending on the type of model that is being worked on. These type of models are commonly split into hard surface models and organic models Although the approach to unwrapping these types of objects are different, the theory is the same for both, and that is to have the UV shells occupy as much of the UV space without stretching or distorting them shells. Typically, hard surface objects can be automatically unwrapped and then pieced to one another using the stitch together and sew tools on the verts and edges of the UV shell. Any parts that need removing from the shell can be broken off with the cut tool. Unlike hard surface unwrapping, I would recommend starting organic unwraps by connecting all the shells together before making any cuts on the UVs. Organic models such as humanoid type characters are unwrapped by making cuts around the appendages without breaking the character into too many shells. This is comparable to how animals are skinned. It's common to work on the UVs by cutting directly onto the edges of the model in the viewport. Once all the cuts have been made, Flatten the UV shells with the Smooth and Unfold tools in the tool drop down menu. Once the object is unwrapped, whether it's hard surface or organic model, it's ready to have its texel density set. This is done in the UV toolkit by setting the density size, selecting all the shells and then hitting the set button. With the texel density set, the shells can be laid out ready to be textured. If needed, a template of the shells can be rendered using Snapshot. This can be found in the UV Editor's Image drop-down menu. That's all for this quick guide. You should now have a basic understanding of what Texels are and the process of unwrapping hard surface and organic models. For a more comprehensive guide on both of these subjects, keep an eye out for my Texel Density Guide and UV Unwrapping Guide, where I will talk about each of these subjects in more depth and demonstrate my own process. That's all for now and I'll catch you next time.